Hi everyone, this is Paris de Bono of the Fortune Teller Shop. In this video, I'm going to ask the question about the coronavirus, moving forward, going forward, what can we expect? And we are in April 2020. Now, I did this reading, this Lenormand reading in a previous video. So you can go and check that video out if you want to see how that unfolded. But the thing that struck me about this reading, recreated it here in this video, is that it was very, very positive. In fact, the only negative card out of these nine is the scythe. So the way that this reading unfolded is the middle card shows a woman, and that was the first card. And the woman, I, I think, represents women leaders in the world. And then it went into the clover, which is luck fish which is plenty and it also means money and then we have here maturity of the lily this could also be read as lucky opportunities and slow growth lily can represent patience also the lily represents older people and if we follow the the line it shows older people have died but it also shows after the sky, we have the flowers, which represents a rebirth or healing. Some positivity comes back and then the stars. Now the stars can represent things spreading, but it also represents hope. Then we follow through with the heart, which is partnership, support, and people working together. And then the child card I see as the coronavirus getting smaller becoming more contained or under control. It's almost like the woman can discipline the child here, okay, and bring the child under control. Now the cards around it are so positive, this looks like a positive outcome. So I wanted to double check it with the tarot. I wanted to see what the tarot also has to say about the same question. So now we're going to try the tarot and we're going to ask the same question about the coronavirus. And the question is basically, what can we learn and understand and know what's coming in the future? And we're going to see the trends for the world and what we might need to look out for or need to be aware of. I'm using my Albus tarot cards with keywords so the heart with the three swords three of swords well that's pretty obvious we've had heartache we've had loss we've had tears we've had illness this represents illness pain suffering And obviously tears, disappointment, sorrow. And restriction, feeling restricted, feeling locked in. That is pretty obvious, these three cards. It's really giving us the story. So it shows heartache, tears, and then social isolating it's like we've got to keep ourselves to ourselves isolation okay let's keep going it's sort of telling us what's happened and what is happening talking and communication and media this could be young people as well and then we have celebrations it's similar to the Lenormand in the sense that it's giving us the sorrow and the heartache and the loss, but it is sort of going into a positive vibe. So let's just take out one more. Slow moving. So the Knight of Pentacles usually means slow moving progress. So again, this is also indicating there is some positive developments. So the Lenormand and the Tarot seem quite similar. 
they're almost echoing each other, which is a good thing. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna try something totally different. This is the Gypsy Queen fortune-telling deck. I wanna see what these ones wanna to add to what the Lenormand and the Tarot are saying. Let's see if they wanna tell us the same or give us anything else. So we have Gossip. Gossip card can also be to do with news, information, Could be sometimes false information too. Home. Could be people staying at home, having to be uh, homebound and then talking on the internet. That could be one way of reading it. It could also be that there's information spreading around from home to home uh, through the news, through the internet. Some of it may be good, some of it may not be. Happiness, okay, that's good. Another sign of happiness. So possibly we're gonna be getting good news. Love, okay, that's good. Cupid, and lo Cupid and love can represent, uh, again, working together, supporting each other and Sickness. Okay, through the sickness, so it's literal, literal through the sickness. So it's sort of saying there's happy, happy information at home, people at home, support through the sickness, and this is li literally nurses, healthcare workers. I'm going to do the sum total now, I'm just going to tally up all the numbers. So we have 35 plus 10 plus 11 plus 15 plus 34 equals 105. So 1 plus 0 plus 5 is 6. So let's see what card number 6 is. There it is there, success. Victory, okay, so this looks very good. Again, this is another positive spread. So it looks like the three different decks of cards are all agreeing with each other. So it looks like we're heading for an improvement with the situation with the coronavirus. So let's hope that this all comes to be as the cards are showing it and predicting it and foretelling it. This is Paris de Bono of the Fortune Teller Shop.